Hi there, welcome to my channel. My name is Jessica. And if you're new here, thank you so much for stopping by. Today's workout is gonna be using our Pilates ring or our magic circle and just your mat. It's gonna be a challenging but hopefully fun workout. Um, a lot of these moves I personally find challenging because I haven't done them in a long time. So I hope you will enjoy the struggle with me and I'll see you in a moment. All right, we're gonna start at the end of the mat. Don't worry if you can't see my face, you will in just a moment. So you're gonna cross one foot over the other. You've got your ring in the heels of your hands. Go ahead and press on that ring, draw your inner thighs up, pull that core tight and lower down, lower down. Grow taller as you lower down, all the way down to the mat. Beautiful, and go ahead and roll back. Go ahead and place that ring in between the ankles there. Beautiful. Lie back for just a moment, enjoy this. Squeeze on the ring, reach the arms back, big inhale. And then exhale, roll it up and start pumping here for your hundreds. Inhale, two, three, four, five. Exhale, two, three, four, five. I want that circle to be an oval here. And just keep pumping here. You're looking down at your pubic bone, down at your navel, big pumps. He wants you to flatten out that stomach, navel to spine. And go ahead and lower the ring and raise it up. Lower the ring and raise it up. Keep pumping, lower, 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 hold, 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 lift, 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 and lower, lower, lower. And go ahead and go for pulses on the ring as we beat our arms. Ah, and then raise it up, pulse, 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 and lower, and pulse, pulse, pulse. <laughs> Can you lower a little bit lower? Keep pumping and raise it up. And lower and raise for five, four, three, two, one. Give me pulses on the ring. Pulse, 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 pulse. Good. Take the ring to your hands. Lengthen the legs away. Let's go for our roll up. Reach the ring behind you. Stretch it out. Lift the arms up. Hold here. Pull that stomach in, squeeze your inner thighs together, and come up and hold. Pull the stomach in, hold, lift up, hold, lift up, hold, hold, and up and over. And then roll it back. Hmm. Lift up, hold, flatten out the stomach, anchor the tailbone, and lift up. Pull the stomach in, round, hold, round, hold and up and over something good roll it back hold hold roll it back hold press your inner thighs together hold and roll it back Whew. reach the arms up lift up come up come up to where you just you can't even hold it and try to hold it yeah lift up lift up up and over good and roll it back, hold here, press on that ring, think armpit muscles, scooping the abdominals, scoop, 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 good. One more, reach the ring up, lift up, plug the shoulders down, drop the tailbone down, roll up, hold, scoop, lift up, hold, scoop even more. Keep lifting the ribs up off of the hips, good, and then roll it back roll it all the way back good get that nice stretch here at the bottom all right left leg stays straight right leg comes up to the ceiling give me a little external rotation of that right leg and really drive that left leg down ring goes up to the ceiling you're going to press in on it all right drop the leg across your body single leg circle and up and up try not to let that pelvis move i know that's tough the more you press on the ring, the stronger that core will be. Last one here and reverse it. Good. Challenge yourself here. Keep that extra rotation of that foot. Last one. Good, switch legs in the air. Flex that right foot, left foot points. Forgive me, cross and lengthen away. Cross. Lengthen away. I'm actually okay with a little bit of wobble today 
because I really want you to push your boundaries here. Normally I'm all about tight circles, but today let's push it and reverse it. <clears throat> Squeeze on that ring, tighten your core, navel to spine. Good, lengthen out of the hip. Last one here, good, and bring it down. Whew. All right, we're gonna skip rolling like a ball, bend your knees into your chest, reach the ring back, lift your head, neck, and shoulders out. Series of five here. Right leg goes out, hold, hold, and switch, hold. All right, feel that yummy stretch, and switch. Squeeze on the ring, switch, and switch, 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 squeeze on the ring. <sighs> Two-way stretch, all right? Energy out of the toes for three, and two, and one. Good, hug it in. Ring goes back again. Lift your head, neck, and shoulders. Legs go out, double leg stretch, and in. Out, and in. Out, bring the ring in, and then hug it in. Out, in, hug it in. Out, ring in, knees in. Take the ring between your ankles, arms and legs go out, hands go to the hips and squeeze on the ring for five, four, three, two, one, hug it in. Arms and legs out, hands go to hips, squeeze on the ring for five, four, three, two, one, one more time, hug it in, out, hands to hips, squeeze, 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 hug it in. Take the ring to your hands. Reach the ring up to the ceiling. Straight legs up, parallel toes pointed. Lift your head, neck, and shoulders. Let's drop the right leg down first. Left shin comes up and switch, and switch, and switch, switch. Good. You're actively pulling that leg up to your face, up to the ring for two and one. Good. Hug it in. Lower and lift. Oh, this one's so lovely. How are you doing so far? Are you warm? I hope so. Take the ring to your thighs here. Not to your ankles, to your thighs. Legs straight up to the ceiling. Make that ring an oval shape. Hands go behind the base of your skull. Inhale as you lower. And exhale to lift. Inhale to lower. Exhale to lift. Can you tap the ring on the mat? This is terrible. Inhale to lower. Exhale to lift. Now take the ring to your ankles. Inhale to lower. Exhale to lift. Lower, hold. Squeeze on the ring for three, two, one. Lift it up. One more time. Lower. Press your head into your hands. Hold for three, two, one. Bend it in. <sighs> All right, let's take the ring to the outsides. Yes, to the outsides of the calves here. Straighten the legs out, hands go back behind the base of the skull. You're gonna twist over to the right for crisscross. Left elbow, right knee, look at that right elbow. As you come to center, straighten the legs. Over to the other side, lift that shoulder up, 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 and center, straighten. Keep the legs straight. Twist over to the right, up, and then bend as you come to center. Straighten the legs, right elbow comes up, switching it up today, and center, one more each side. You got this, Woo. to center, and lift up, look at that elbow, and center, and drop the head down for just a moment. Whew. Readjust if you need to. Reach that ring back, heels together, toes apart, legs are lengthened, big inhale, and then exhale. Roll up. Whew. All right, let's go for our spine stretch here. Legs are straight, feet are flexed. All right, that ring is out in front of you, and I want you sitting up so tall. All right, so if you've got a tight low back, tight hamstrings, think of sticking the booty out. All right, big inhale. And then exhale, press the ring down to get tall tall and release. One great thing about the ring is it gives you so much lift, right? Use the resistance of the ring to lift up, up 
and release. Big inhale. And then exhale, press, 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 and release. Last one, I want you to ring it out. I want you to lift those ribs up. Exhale, press, press. Stick the booty out, armpits pulling down, ribs are pulling up, crown of the head is reaching up, up, and release. Let's go for a little flexion here. All right, so we're gonna go for the presses again, but just a little rounding of the spine, big inhale, and then exhale, press, press, press and release. So it's not a tipping forward. I'm looking for a spine stretch. So really think of rounding your low back and exhale, pulling your stomach into your low back and release. But you're still chasing that lift of the rib cage up, up. Good. Last one here. Ring it out. Exhale, press, press. Find that two weight stretch in Pilates. Good. All right, let's bend those knees. Let's find, let's find the, um, the ring between our ankles, actually. Let's do that, all right? So find your knees bent. Let's go ahead and bring those legs up for our open leg rocker, but we're just gonna do some holds today, okay? All right, hold it here. All right, so I want a rounded low back, but an open chest, okay? And just stabilize here. Try your best not to have a death grip on those legs. Your elbows are wide, your ears are lifted off your shoulders, and just hold. This is challenging right here. Hold, hold, and then lower down with control. All right, let's do it again. Hands go back behind the legs and lift it up and hold. Woo! <laughs> I think I'm still sore from yesterday. Just hold it wherever you can today. All right, hold and squeeze on that ring. Activate those inner thighs for two, one, and lower down. Let's take the ring away for just a moment. Bend those knees, hug them in tight. All right, so my legs are together here to start. Go ahead and bend them. All right, scoop those abdominals. The more you scoop, the more you'll find balance. Open up your legs and then close them. Just doing a little fanning open and close, open, and close, and then open, hold here. Can you straighten your legs? Woo, and bend them. Can we straighten the legs? And bend them. You should feel this intense abdominal contraction when you try to straighten those legs, and bend. Straighten, Oop. and bend. Close your legs and drop them down. All right, let's take the ring back behind the ankles. You're gonna lie back, legs go up to the ceiling. All right, those hands are gonna go out to the side like a letter T or your arms. All right, really press your legs down. All right, and we're just gonna reach our legs over to the right. The hips can lift up and back to center. Over to the left and to center. This is kind of our, our TikTok corkscrew prep here. Over to the right and to center. So use those arms and to center. And to center. Good. Now lower the legs and then lift them up. Lower the legs. Lift them up like you're trying to lift your booty but just a little bit. All right. Lift them up and lower. Now as you lift them up I want you to drop them down to the right and then lift them up over to the left and lift them up. Okay, so there's a little bit of rotation here. You're still squeezing on that ring. And up and over to the left one last time. And up, hug it in for just a moment. Whew. I know we're going a little bit out of order here with the classical series. So keep that ring in between your ankles. Arms are down by your side. Lengthen your legs away. Let's go for our rollover. So reach the legs back. I want you to lift the hips up off of the ribs here, all right? Try to get your legs at 90 if you can, if you're flexible enough. And now roll it back down, roll it back down. Slow, 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 slow. Lengthen the legs away. And then exhale, lift the hips up. Try to find that parallel position with your legs. Feel that stretch in your low back. 
big inhale and then exhale roll it down slow slow and controlled good and down one more time i lied maybe we'll do it another time hold it find that stretch scoop the abdominals lengthen your back and lower 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 good last one i promise and back good scoop the abdominals find the lift all right don't sink down and then lower 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 good beautiful hug your knees into your chest for just a moment find those legs straight out reach the ring behind you big inhale and then exhale roll it up round forward now we'll do our seated twist little seated twist and then we'll do our side bend so ring is going to go to your heels now all right so really press inward on that ring i want you to feel this inner thigh connection all the way up arms are going to go out to it like a letter t inhale grow tall and then exhale twist as you press even more on the ring look at that right hand and to center twist 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 good sit up even taller squeeze even more on that ring to center find this two-way stretch so as that hand reaches back the other hands reaching forward forward to center one more time over open up the chest good take the ring to the hands legs are still spread apart feet are flexed let's do our side bend here it's gonna be a beautiful stretch but still oblique work ring goes above the head you're gonna to rotate to the right first side bend over to the left round up and over something feel the stretch anchor the right hip down and then restock center and over side bend side bend really reach that top arm away and anchor that right hip down down and up are you feeling this amazing stretch i hope stretch stretch and up so be careful not to bounce i want them to be very um intentful pulses okay so not bounces very controlled pulses there we go that's the word i'm looking for reach and reach and reach and up center over last one here really make it count feel the stretch reach that top arm away 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 and up and center beautiful take the ring to the side we're going to turn over on our stomach and do some booty ham stuff how are you feeling so far invigorated perhaps so you're going to place it right in your butt crease i'm going with my left side first so padded part in one butt crease the other padded part is going to go right into the heel of my foot all right so i'm up on my forearms or my elbows here elbows under shoulders that right leg is straight that left leg is bent now we're not hanging out at the beach so don't let your ribs sink pull your ribs up pull the stomach up lightly press your pubic bone down and go for some presses press and lightly release press press and release legs are squeezing together press press and release Whew. press press and release now on this next one i want you to find a two-way stretch so i want you to try and lengthen that left knee away okay and then slightly lift it up off the mat if you can open up your chest feel a stretch in your abdominals press 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 and release two more times press press and release last one here make it count pull that stomach in open up your chest good and release Whew. switch legs you're feeling that burn on that one? Oh my goodness okay elbows underneath legs glued together go ahead for those presses presses and release press press and release press press and release Whew. pull that stomach up and in all right on this next one try to float that right knee up open up the chest even more and press press and release 
And as you can tell, it's not really a release because you still have to hold on to it. Oh, my right leg is shaking. Press, press, and release. Last one here, make it count. Press, press, ah, and release. Whew. All right, take the ring to your hands now. We'll do our single leg kick and then we'll do our double leg kick. Just in case you didn't get enough hamstrings there. So again, find that same position, stomach pulled up and impress on that ring. This time I want you to try and lift both knees up, glue them together, and let's go for our kicks. Kick, 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 and switch. Kick, 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 and lengthen. Kick, 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 lengthen the leg away, okay? Again, looking for that two-way stretch here. There's energy out of the crown of your head and there's energy out of those toes. You should be getting a really nice stretch in those thighs. Last one here, and lengthen. Beautiful. Let's take the ring behind here. You're gonna turn onto your right ear, all right? And you're gonna drop your elbows down. So you should be getting this nice stretch, maybe uncomfortable. Legs are glued together, press the pubic bone down, all right? You're gonna kick, kick, kick with both legs lengthen the legs away and then reach the ring away good turn your ear to the other side draw the ring up and kick 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 Oop, almost lost it and up squeeze your shoulder blades together good and kick 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 lengthen reach reach good this time you're going to take your hands to the inside of the ring when we lengthen away okay so kick 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 and then press the ring away open up the chest there you go kick 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 keep those knees lifted up press into the ring good kick 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 up press press good and lengthen down take the ring off to the side for a moment let's come up find that rounded back good counter stretch here all right let's come to kneeling I'll come facing this way all right so if you have your knees apart slightly apart it's gonna be a little bit easier if you have them glued together it's gonna be a little bit harder I want those feet in line with your knees if you've got this tall neutral spine here so think of driving the pubic bone slightly forward arms are reaching forward press on the ring for our thigh stretch lower or lean back rather and lift up so keep the gaze forward on a fixed point on a wall all right so you're not allowing your gaze to go up inhale as you lower back and then exhale up you should be feeling this intense contraction in your knees but also a stretch at the same time hence the name thigh stretch <laughs> inhale lower back 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 and up so keep that booty in line with the rest of your body Ribs are pulling back and up. Last one here. Lengthen, 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 and up. Good. Let's now come to seated, and we'll do our neck pull. But this time, let's place our ring between our heels again. All right, once you've got that in position, neck pull. This is one of those that not a huge fan of they're brutal hands go behind the base of the skull get those elbows wide with a flat back you're going to hinge back as far as you can all right hold it squeeze on that ring and then you're going to roll it back Good. keep the hands here lift your chin up look at yourself for a moment and then roll up come forward get that nice stretch in your back restack your spine hinge back and then roll back roll it up find the stretch good restack hinge back reach the heels away pulse on or uh, pressure on that ring and then roll it back roll it up <laughs> round forward are you struggling with me yet <laughs> Hinge back, hold, embrace the shake, pull the stomach in, and roll it back. Whew. Last one here, roll it up. <clears throat> Round forward, find yourself a nice stretch here. 
good. And restack your spine. Let's take the ring off to the side and let's do our bridge here. So go ahead and lie back on your mat. Have that ring close to you and have your feet underneath your knees here. All right, this will, you'll really be able to find a stretch and also your booty. So go ahead and lift the hips up. You're gonna place the ring underneath you here. All right, so I really want you to squeeze your shoulder blades together, squeeze the ring. All right, and it's not gonna be much, but I want you to think about it, okay? Because I want you to open up your chest. So I just want you to come down, staying in a neutral spine, and then lift the hips up. So just get connected here. All right, so find even hips, take a peek at them, make sure they're not lopsided, and lower down. Squeeze on the ring, all right? Feel that back body kick on, but you still have long fingertips, all right? Shoulders are out of the ears. Good, hold it up here in your bridge. Shift your weight to your left foot, bring that right leg up, straighten, bend, and down. Left leg up. Straighten, get a stretch, bend, and down. All right, shift to the other side. Up, here, let's go for our kicks. Flex the foot, lengthen it away. Point it, and up. Point it, and up. Don't let that left leg move. Drive down through that foot and press on the ring. Oh, it's so hard. Good, feel the stretch in the abdominals as you lengthen the leg away. Last one, reach it up and place it down. Keep the hips lifted. Left leg goes up, flex the foot, lengthen it away. If you start to feel this in your back, maybe lower your hips or don't let the leg go down as far. Every side is different, okay? Keep pressing on the ring, open up the chest. And breathe, please. Last one. And drop it down, take the ring away. Good. Hug your knees in. Whew. Give yourself some love. Let's go for our side lying. So I want your upper body to be in line with the back edge of the mat. Your legs are going to be forward. So right now I'm looking at my heels and they're in line with the other edge of the mat. So depending on how long you are, it might look a little different. So ring is going to go. Actually, let's place the bottom leg inside the ring and the top leg on top all right so you're on your right elbow I'm on my right side right here all right and that top arm is planted into the mat all right so neck is long so I'm not sinking I'm like pressing my head into my hands my elbows pressing down I'm feeling my side body kick on and both legs are long here all right I'm just gonna press on the ring and release Press on the ring and release. So that top hand is pressing into the mat, okay? I want you to use that to find your lift here on your side body and you're lengthening out of that top leg and release. Press and release. Whoo, how are you doing? That bottom leg is active too. Toes are pointed here and release. We're in the parallel position and release and let's go for quick pulses pulse 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 oh, and smile keep that neck long for two and one good now just give me some light pressure on the top leg all right now you're gonna lift the bottom leg up and down up and down so try your best not to let your upper body shift down in order to get your bottom leg up Okay, up and down, up and down. Let's have some fun. You're gonna circle the leg forward, back and around, forward. So you're just kind of tracing the circle here. <laughs> oh my goodness. Try your best to touch the top without moving your upper body. Last one here <laughs> and circle it back and around. It's been forever since I've done these. These are terrible. I hope you're having fun though. Whew. And around, last one here. Good. Now, press that bottom leg in the floor, all right? And give me a little turnout position here with that top leg. All right, and go for press downs here. So just working at different inner parts of the inner thigh and release. Press, get those legs long. How's that underarm doing? 
Oh, this is definitely full body right here. Press and release. Press and release. You got it. Pull those ribs in. All right, that back is flat up against that imaginary wall behind you. And release. Good. All right, let's come to the other side. Whatever side you didn't do that time, I'll meet you there. Back in line with the mat. Find that bottom leg on the inside. And if you're finding yourself kind of slipping, if you notice I've rolled up my pants in order to get contact with the circle. So find that left elbow down. I'm gonna move my microphone there. All right, so top legs are long, both legs are long. All right, and then go for those presses. So we're in parallel here, all right? And you, don't be afraid to use that top arm to press down. And press, press, and release. Press, press, and release. <sighs> Do your best to keep your gaze forward, right? And don't look down at your foot. If you're here, we're not doing anything good for the neck. Good. And release. All right, let's go for those pulses. Controlled pulses here. Both legs are long, long, long stomach pulled in and the ribs are pulled into that back control control for three two one good lightly press on the top of that ring let's go for those lift and lower lift and lower you should be feeling your obliques your armpit muscles a lot of things right now good try your best to touch the top if you can while keeping good form for two and one let's go for the tracing of the circle whichever direction you choose ha ah. oh this one is harder which one is it for you try to trace it try to do the best you can don't be afraid to reach that leg back touch the ring somewhere Whew. last one here on this side and reverse it oh my goodness good Feel those obliques working. Don't allow your upper body to sink. Ribs are pulled into your back. Neck is long. Shoulders are out of the ears. Last one here. Good. And drop it down. Let's go for those external pulls, all right? Good. Just working a different part. You might even feel your booty kick on a little bit. Don't forget to press down with that elbow. Ah. And say, I love Pilates. <laughs> Oh my goodness. There's so much we can do with this magic circle. It's amazing. Down and release. Down and release. Long legs here. Reach out and away. Last one here. Hold it. Hold it. Good. Oh, beautiful. All right, let's come up. We're actually going to come to seated. Facing the camera, facing the TV, and we're just going to do some seated presses before we do our kneeling leg stuff, all right? We're going to move through this pretty quick. So have that ring, all right, in line with your hip, okay? And this is all we're going to do. We're just going to press, press, and release. So if you find your hand out here comfortable, that's fine. Hand here. I like it here. It gives me a little bit of a, a stable base. So press to find the lift, just like we did with those forward presses. And release. And also, don't allow your knees to come up, all right? So actively pull your knees down. And release. Armpits pulling down. Think side body here, pull those knees down, feel your booty kick on and grow tall, tall and switch sides. Padded part in line with the booty here. My hand is in line with my shoulder, soft bend to the elbow, press, knees pulling down, grow tall and release. Feel those ribs lifting up off of the hips and release. This magic circle is amazing for finding lift it gives you such good feedback. And that's what our props are for. Let us know what we're doing. And release, good. Relax the neck, all right? Tuck the chin in slightly, give me one more. 
press, press, and release. Good. Let's go for a little counter stretch here. And then over to the other side. Good. So we're gonna move pretty quick through the side kneeling. We won't be here long. So first come to kneeling. I'm gonna to go to my right side first. You pick whichever side you choose to begin with. So ring in line with my knees. I'm gonna reach my left leg out. And now I'm gonna press into my ring. I'm gonna find a side bend. You can have your hand here. You can have your hand here. Wherever is comfortable for you, you're gonna to have to find where the ring is best. All right, and go for those leg pulses, pulse pulse so try your best not to allow the ring to move <laughs> and think of driving that hip forward okay sides of the waist are long and even good for two and one good let's draw little circles circle gazes forward or whatever shape you decide to make <laughs> ah! armpits pulling down to the hips for two and one Good, reverse it. Oh my goodness. All right, tummy is pulled in, ribs are pulled into your back for two and one. Beautiful, draw the knee in, let's switch sides. How are those butt cheeks doing? Ring in line with the knees, get situated here. Find that right leg out. So everything is in line right here. My foot is in line with my hip, in line with my ear, go for it. Every side's different. There we go. So obviously the more you press into the ring, the more you rely on the ring, the more side body you have to use on that opposite side and the less it takes out of your butt. So you pick, what do you wanna work? Your butt, side body, good. Working in this parallel position for two and one, go for those circles, whichever direction you choose. <sighs> and you're just lightly tapping that mat when you come to center. Even harder, don't let it touch. For two and one, Woo. and circle. And circle, we reversed it. Woo. Collarbone is wide. All right, pull the stomach in, drive the hips forward for two and one. Good, drop it down. All right, staying on our knees. Let's come to our right side. All right, so my feet are together, my knees are together. We'll do our mermaid here. Again, we're trying to find lift. So like those side presses we did, but this one's more intense. Ring in line with my booty, all right? Let's go bicep to ear. I'm on my right side, and then I'm gonna press to lift. So I want you to think about lifting that opposite rib cage away from the ring. All right, you see this is a tiny movement and release. Legs are squeezing together. Big inhale and then exhale, press, press. So I'm thinking of scrunching up the side to the ring and opening up this side, lifting up, feel the stretch and release. Big inhale and then exhale, press, press. Squeeze your inner thighs together. Keep the chest open, right? We're not dipping down and release one more time. Press into the ring and almost press yourself away from it. Press, press, and release. Let's switch sides. All right. Legs are zipped up together. Bicep to ear, good. And press, 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 and release. This should be a very intense abdominal contraction here. Press, lift that opposite rib cage away, 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 and release. And then exhale, press, squeeze those inner thighs together. Press, press, and release. Press, press, lift up, pull that armpit to your hip. Enjoy the squeeze and release. Drop the ring down, I forgot our counter stretch. So grab onto that leg and stretch, stretch. Good, let's do the other side. Since I cheated us out of that, so grab onto that ankle, that leg if you can, and find that two-way stretch. Oh, that feels so good. 
All right, we're gonna round this out with some planks, but with the ring between our ankles. So let's see how gracefully we can do this. I'm going to start standing. I'm gonna place that ring between my ankles. Again, I've rolled up my leg, my leggings if you've got pants on. And I'm going to tilt my circle like so, almost like I'm trying to get it parallel with my legs or in line. So give that ring a good squeeze. All right, now you're gonna roll it down. You're gonna walk out to a plank, keep squeezing on the ring. All right, walk out to the plank, squeeze on the ring. Squeeze on the ring. Now we're gonna rotate that right leg up and over, keep squeezing on the ring, and we're gonna press on the ring. We're gonna press on the ring. All right. Our shoulders are still square, our hips are just rotated. And press. Legs are long, press, and come to center. Rotate that left leg up and over, and press, and release. Press, and release. Ooh, and release. Press, and release. Press, and release. Come to center, and go ahead and drop it down. All right, on this next one, Again, this is my most challenging. I'm saving it for last here. We're gonna do our side bend. So, you're gonna find, I'm on my right side right now. So that ring is in between my ankles again. Let's see if we can do this. This is our grand finale here. All right, so find that bottom foot flexed wherever you're at. And let's start on our forearms. Our knees are bent to start because when we lift up, our legs are gonna straighten. All right, so lift up, squeeze on the ring, reach the arm up and over. Good, feel that contraction on one side, stretch on the other, and bend the knees and drop it down. So that was our tester. If you feel good with that, let's come to the hand. If not, stay there. All right, so use that top arm to brace you if you need. Lift up, good, and reach the arm up and over. Open up the chest. Good. Hold. Find that stretch. Good. Bend the knees and drop it down. And again, <laughs> if that's not for you, maybe the ring's not for you, then come down to your regular side bend where you have both feet on the floor. All right, this is challenging. So this next one, we're going to add a little threading of the hand. You go to where you need to. Press on that ring. Lift up. Lift up. Hold here and then go for the twist. Whoo, twist, press on that ring. <laughs> Just hold it where you can. Good, thread it through and bend the knees and drop it down. <laughs> oh, all right, gotta do the other side. So let's first start on our forearms. I like a little tester because every side is different. So, good, all right. So get that elbow underneath your shoulder here. Gotta get it just right. All right, when you're ready, go ahead and lift up. All right, reach that top arm up and over. Square off the chest. Reach that bottom leg away. Good, and then drop it down. All right, if you're good with that, let's go to the hand. Whew, we're almost done, guys, we're almost done. Lift up. Squeeze on the ring to get you a good base. Good. Just find the stretch. Find the lift in the rib cage up to the ceiling. Pull the stomach in. Good. And then drop it down. Whew. You know what's coming next. The thread, the needle. Let's see how we can do this. All right. So the hand's actually slightly forward of the shoulder because we're going to come up over it. So let's lift up. Oh my goodness, and thread it through. Thread it. Thread, thread. Squeeze on the ring. Last thread. Ah! Ah! And drop it down. Oh my goodness. Place the ring off to the side. I hope you're having fun. <laughs> And let's just 
Round the spine forward, reach the hands forward. Curl the tailbone under. Really sit those hips back. Walk the hands over to the right and sit the hips over to the left. And then let's walk the hands over to the left. Sit your hips over to the right. Good, and then slowly roll up and you are done. I hope you enjoyed this. I hope you had fun with me. I hope you struggled a little bit and laughed. As always, please leave me a comment. Let me know what you thought. And I hope to see you next time. Thanks.